Hey fam, welcome back to my channel. So, Atiku and PDP members withdraw suit from tribunal on permission to inspect election materials, which means that they are no longer interested in pursuing the outcome of the election in the courts. So, automatically they've accepted APC intimidation because recently APC came out, okay, just after the, the, the presidential results was announced, APC came out to say if the opposition party aren't happy or are not satisfied with the outcome of the election, that they should take the case to the court. So, um... Labour Party has registered the case already. Likewise, that of PDP, uh, they've also requested that the court should give them the permission to inspect the uh, presidential election materials. But a um, few days back, you saw how uh, sorry how PDP uh, presidential candidates in the person of Atiku and the rest of the PDP members took to the street to protest on the irregularity of INEC on that very day, their failure to upload the results on the beavers as they promised, okay? So, I don't know why they are coming out now to say they are no longer interested. I thought they are going to pursue this to the end, just like the way Labour Party is doing. I will just say that maybe probably they've accepted the intimidation or they, they, they've been intimidated by the ruling party. Let's not forget that PDP also rigged in this election. The only difference between PDP and APC is that why APC is able to win is because they are, they, they, uh, they are, they are in position, they are in power. Why? Meanwhile, PDP is not in power. They also rigged just that they are not able to, you know, get to that um get into power and i think probably this is why they are withdrawing the case because if if the case if they continue pursuing the case it will you know it will it might backfire on them and let's also not forget that this is not the first time that this pdp candidate is running for the office of the president he ran for the, he has run for the office of the pre, um of the president for in nigeria for like six uh, times now he has he ran in 1993 2007, 2011, 2015, 2019, and in 2023. And in all these years, he is always losing. And I guess this should, this should be the last time uh, this man article should come out to run because it's as if <laughs> it's as if he has nothing to do. What he does is, you know, when it's time for presidential election, he comes back from Dubai to run. And you guys, don't be surprised that he's going to run again in 2027. Don't be surprised. This man is never tired of running for the office of the president. It's as if he's making some money out of it. I just want to believe that, okay? So, and all this while he has run... It has been uh, fruitful, like it hasn't been fruitful for him. He has recently lost the election to uh, APC, who is the ruling party. And uh, you guys, I just don't want to believe that APC won this election. Honestly, I just don't want to believe. You guys, let me know what you think in the comment section. And let me know what could be the reason why PDP is withdrawing the case. I thought they were, you know, bold enough to challenge the case in the court. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. And do not forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed already. Thank you so much for watching. See you in my next one. Till then, bye.